Hey everybody, how you doing? This is video on Legion of the Damned Codex. Yay. We're going to cover the entire Codex in this one video, which we'll see if we can squeeze it in. According to the Codex, the Legion of the Damned can be an independent army. Um, which I guess this changes the Space Marine Codex, which just lists them as a choice, but now they are allies or they're their own army with their own warlord. Now, the Legion of the Dam gives you massive a choice lists of one unit. Yes, the Legion of the Damned Codex is consists of one, one unit. And it's called a Legion of the Dam Squad. Which is basically a tactical marine squad. Actually, more like a veteran space, a veteran squad. It is an elite choice, which is interesting. They don't have HQ or troops, so I'm assuming that they're going to make some exception for these guys. If uh, <laughs> if you're if you're a Legion of the Damned army, one unit, and it's an elite choice, and it's basically four Legionnaires and a Legionnaire sergeant. If you want to make your own army, you have to you have to upgrade that to a veteran sergeant. It comes with all the standard equipment of a Space Marine. It uh, has the stat line of a Space Marine with the two attacks. Uh, special rules are aid unlooked for. Fear, fearless, flaming projectiles, slow and purposeful. That's going to be a kick in the balls for some people. Uh, and unyielding specters. Their options are pretty much the same. You know, they won one... Legionnaire can upgrade to a special weapon, the Flamer Meltaplasma. The other one can upgrade to a heavy version of a Flamer Meltaplasma and Missile Launcher and Plasma Cannon and Laz Cannon, I believe. Okay. Uh, the Sergeant can take a, a Chain Sword uh, or a Power Weapon or a Power Fist. He can also upgrade to the standard special weapons, which is a Storm Bolter, Combi, Flamer, Grav, Melta, or Plasma, uh, Grav Pistol, and a Plasma Pistol. Um, and the army has one relic known as the Animus Malorum, which can be bought by, by the Veteran Sergeant. That's it. That's that's their war gear choice. I guess they have to give them one. So what is then the Animus Malorum? What is this incredible thing that they have? Well, I'll read it to you. Basically, as I understand it, it's a flaming skull. Yes. The Animus Malorum. Accounts vary as to the exact description of the sinister relic known as the Animus Malorum. Some claim it to be a baleful skull born into battle, holding true to the legend of Attica Centurius. Others insist that it is a formed as a part of the war ghostly warrior's spectral armor, as if the Animus Malorum and the damned legionnaire were somehow one. Despite their divergent theories, as to its exact nature, these reports are unanimous in describing the horrific effects of the Animus Malorum. The skull's victim visibly withers beneath its sightless stare as unwholesome energies draw forth the target's soul. Each time this macabre event takes place, the phantasmal haze that surrounds the warriors in the skull's presence condenses, rendering them all but immune to physical harm. Within this etheric miasma, rent armor reforms, intangible flesh knits together, and fallen legionnaires Rise to do battle once more. <laughs> so what incredible power does this godlike relic give you? It gives you feel no pain. <laughs> 
I kid you not. After all that hype, the object gives the unit bearer feel no pain. Okay, it has a little twist to it, though. Um, any pinning, morale, or fear check that is failed within 12 inches of the bearer, not the whole unit, just the bearer, 12 inches, any failed check like that, one unit model in that unit is automatically killed just take it off the table no saving throws no nothing blam you can do a lookout sir roll for it as normal apparently people this is going to reflect the soul of that uh, that model being sucked out into into the animus malorum and uh and that's that now for every single death that you cause like that, your feel no pain roll is improved to a uh, two plus. So it starts at the five plus, and then uh, you can get up to two plus. That is it. That is the Animus Malorum, and that is the entirety of the Legion of the Damned Army. Enjoy. See you next time. Bye.